Okay, well, um, I'm going to show you today how to log into and navigate through the Civics Online Textbook. So first thing we're going to do is um, enter in the username, which is the same for everybody. It's VVS student, and the password is 7 virtual. And we just click login. Okay, you choose the Civics book. When you click on it, um, this will come up, okay? We're not going to do any assignments or projects within this because you all don't have separate logins. We're using all we're all using the same logins. So you're not going to use this to submit assignments or do any sort of assessment. And what you're going to use this for is strictly for the textbook portion. So you can go to the chapter if you highlight it. Um, uh, arrow menu arrow pops up and you can choose any chapter. So the directions of the assignment that you're given will tell you which chapter to choose. So for example, I choose chapter 6 for the Bill of Rights and press go. That will take me to that chapter. You can see across the top here, they have a menu. Okay, we have a chap every chapter has a chapter opener. Um, you can play. Press play. Oh, I do not have access to that. Okay. Um, you can read it if you press this. It reads it out loud to you. Okay, you can click it again to stop it. All right, and then Real Life Civics is another tab. Um, it's very interactive. You can click on the pictures. There's questions at the bottom. And I might have you sometimes answering those questions. It'll tell you in the assignment. And I'll give you the questions in the assignment. Um, if you click on the lesson, they're across the top too. Okay, and you can click on standards that it's going to go over. Um, you can click on the vocabulary that are in the lesson. And reading strategies, these are note-taking sheets. You can download them and print them off just by clicking on them. Okay. And then you just press print, or you can fill it out and print it out. Um, I'm not going to collect that. I, I have no way of collecting it. I have to do it in a different way. Um, you can have it read to you. You can highlight the text by clicking up here. Uh, it says there's some things in Spanish um, across here. Right, well, down at the bottom, there's page numbers. And then at the very end, there's a review of the lesson. OK, there's lesson resources in this window. And if you click on them, um, sometimes there are movies, pictures, other things that have to do with the lesson. Uh, there's a feature in every chapter. And these are usually Supreme Court cases that we'll talk about. So feature one would be the first feature. If there's another feature, I would call it feature two. Um, there's lessons, um, and it will tell you in the directions which lesson to work on, and activities and assessments. Um, if I have you do these at all, it will be within your course, not within this online textbook. Because if you type an answer here, um, it's not going to send it to me. So don't type your answers directly in the textbook. Well, you can, but I just, just know that you're going to have to retype them somewhere else because I won't get them here. Um, and that's, that's it. You can go to other chapters from here and navigate through other chapters. Um, if you have any questions about, about the online textbook, just email me or call me.